Welcome to Beyond Labs version 3. If you're viewing this video, that means you have a student account, and this is just a brief overview of the student view for Beyond Labs. You'll notice a banner at the top of each of these menus where you can get helpful videos and tips, a support button in the top right corner where you can get support if you need it, this web button, which is the default view for our home page, which is where you launch the labs, and a desktop button where you can launch and install our desktop labs. For details on the desktop labs, check out our how to install our desktop labs video. In the lower left corner is an icon that will reveal your username as well as your status. It should say student and where you'll be able to view your profile, see our terms and conditions and our privacy policy or sign out. If you click on view profile, it will take you to a page where you can view your license information, change your password, and update your school affiliation if you would like. You'll also notice that this reveals the full name of each of the icons in our menu. You can also reveal this menu by clicking on the triple bar in the upper left corner. And we have our menus here. And if you click on any one of these, there will be a video at the top of each one of these to showing what they are and how you can utilize them as a student. To launch the lab as a student, simply click on the lab card and that will launch the lab in its default state. You can also click on this triple dot here to see an intro video about the lab that goes over what the lab can do, activities that are associated with this lab, as well as presets that are associated with the lab as well. If you would like specific help on a lab bench, once that lab has launched, you can click on the bell on that lab bench and it will launch our help article database for that specific lab. That is a brief overview of the student view of Beyond Labs version three. If you have questions, feel free to reach out to us at Beyond Labs.